Namaste, welcome, Wandanon. Welcome to Futoshi and Fish Channel. I'm Futoshi. Today I'm gonna eat the Sankara Red Snipper. So I will make a uh, two dish. Let's get started. Today I'm going to make uh, this fish, uh, Sankara. English name is uh, Red Snapper. And uh, this big fish is uh, I'm going to make a uh, simmered fish. This small fish I make the soup. Let's get started. First I'm going to remove the scale. Oh this uh, this sankara is a uh, very beautiful. Mm. So red and uh, yellow. So it's nice. Uh, we cook. so English name is uh, maybe a red snapper, but it is a little different. Uh, Japanese red snapper. Japanese red snapper is just the red, uh, but uh, this sankara has a lot of color and uh, pink and uh, yellow, so it's very beautiful. And uh, the Chennai a fisherman uh, told me. Sankara is a very tasty fish, so I'm very uh, I'm very excited to eat uh, this fish. And the scale is also it's easy to remove. The point remove the scales. Uh, the point is uh, from here and uh, here, so tail to head. So then uh, we. Uh, I need to remove like this. So then it's easy to remove the scale. This is the point. After I remove the scale, so now I'm going to cut the gears and the guts. Yeah, open the gears and the cut here to remove the gears. And I need to cut them here also. Yeah. I think it's more easy to remove the gears. Yeah, like that. Oh, then uh, gut, gut is also coming. And I need to cut the here. To remove the gut yeah. and clean the whole gut mm. okay. like this. Okay, wash it properly. So there are another organ or in the body there. So please remove. Okay. Okay. After I remove the gut and gears, I'm going to make a swallow cut. Why I do the swallow cut? So when I boil the fish, so the meat is going to shrink. But if uh, when I make a swallow cut, meat is not shrink and we can eat the fish tasty. This fish is uh, very small, so just only the cross cut. Like this, and uh, enough. After that, uh, uh, I need to pour the hot water to three seconds. Uh, so then uh, I can remove the curry uh, there are scales. Pour the hot water to three seconds. That's it. Then I will put it into the cold water. After fish become cold, I will wash the fish with running water. We will calculate the uh, fish's weight. Then uh, we can understand how much we need the ingredient. 
water is 200 and sugar is three spoon and uh, mirin Japanese say mirin this is a uh, is fermented rice uh, four spoon and uh, soy sauce four spoon this is Japanese sake now I'm going to mix all ingredient and the fast water and uh, Japanese say mirin soy sauce and sugar and Japanese sake then uh, I boiled after boiled I will put in the fish in the pan oh nice uh, a good smell so it started boiling so then I put the all fish in the pan. Okay. After that, I need to put. The I put the paper. Uh, so then, uh, the, a lot of uh, ingredient into the fish, so it becomes more tasty. I got this fish, Sankara, uh, in Chennai. I got this fish from the uh, fisherman directory. So it is very fresh. So, but I have never eaten the uh, Sankara. So I'm very excited to eat this. So what kind of taste? And uh, mm, I, I can't imagine. I'm very excited. Uh, in Chennai, uh, when I uh, go to the beach side, so many people uh, told me, Dongri, Dongri, wow, Dongri, Dongri. Oh, so then I, I'm, why uh, they uh, told me the Dongri? I'm very curious about it. And uh, after that, I'm going to back to the hotel. I'm the search the Google and uh, Dongri in Tamil. And then, uh, Chinese actor, very handsome Chinese actor there. So it is Dongri. So it, uh, he is very famous in the Chennai. So th that's why he, he, they told me Dongri, Dongri. After that, I will uh, uh, call my friend. So I, I'm, so many people told me Dongri. So uh, I told uh, my friend. Then my friends are uh, such as Dongli, and uh, so oh he is oh yeah he is a uh, look uh, look like Sutoshi oh and uh, but he is a uh, more uh, he is a uh, fatter uh, than me oh hmm? real yes but uh, yeah uh, Dongli is uh, similar to me uh, similar to Futoshi. then I will uh, search the Dongli. Another dongri, his ring. Then I watch this. Then <laughs> there is a fat dongri. This is, he is very fat. Uh, but uh, actually, he, he fat dongri and me uh, it's similar. And but this handsome dongri and me and similar. So now I'm the, between the fat dongri and the handsome dongri. Here, this is me, Futoshi. Yeah, I add the ginger. This is for the smell. Then I will once more. Then uh, after one minute later, uh, it's finished. One minute later. Mm. <sighs> it's so good. Very tasty. I think it's tasty. It smells very good. Mmm, I can't wait. Going to make miso soup using sankara. After after wash, I make fillet, but this time uh, I will use a bone. So, but I will uh, make a fillet. 
Let's cut the head. Wash the head and bone. After wash, I pour the hot water to remove the uh, scale. Today I'm going to make a miso soup, so I will use this miso. And uh, we add some Japanese sake, vegetable, radish, Chinese cabbage, and the leek and carrot. Put in the fish and carrot, radish, Chinese cabbage, and leek. We add the Japanese sake. Uh, we are going to wait uh, uh, in 15 minutes. Afterwards, uh, we add the soy miso. 10 minutes later. Okay, we need to remove the scum. Scum is a bad smell and not so, not so tasty. So, okay, add the ginger and we will wait uh, one minute. Then I stop the fire, then uh, I will uh, put on the miso, then finish. Then I stop the fire. After that, I will add the miso, like this, and yeah. So. After stopping the fire and add miso, this is a point to make a miso soup because uh, miso is very mm, healthy. But if I uh, uh, over hundred uh, Celsius uh, miso, uh, good things is gone. So that's why uh, the point is stop and add the miso. Yeah, finally, I made a uh, silver fish and uh, miso soup with uh, using sankara. Uh, we call the uh, English name is uh, red sniper, but I use uh, sankara today. And uh, so, first I will try similar. Oh. oh, smell is very good. It's tender and uh, mm, fluffy. Very good. Tasty. I'm gonna eat one more. Mm. Mm. Wow. <laughs> it's delicious. Mmm. Have you tried miso soup? Oh, yes, it's a uh, it's excellent, uh, very excellent, beautiful, uh, and uh, mm. so there's a lot of umami come from the bone mm. from. From him. Okay. 
one more I taste. Hmm. Very nice. Then I wanna drink. <laughs> <laughs> delicious! <laughs> wow, I use Japanese word delicious in my. <laughs> but it's incredibly good. So, this fish is uh, very fresh, so that's why it's very tasty. And uh, see, this is white meat. So, white meat fish. It's good to smell fish. Mm. Wow, I want I want to eat a lot of rice in here. Wow. Mm. So I got uh, from this fish in the Chennai. So I I I catch the, I get this fish from Chennai. So I have uh, a lot of story uh, in this fish. So the fisherman recommend me Sankara. It's very delicious. So now I can understand how it is good. Yeah, I'm thank you, uh, my uh, thank you, the fisherman. I'm very happy to eat the uh, sankara. Today, I got uh, a lot of uh, experience. Of course, the uh, sankara fish, and uh, not only that, I went to the Chennai, and uh, I got the fish uh, from the fisherman. So fisherman recommend me. Uh, so I today I have uh, I got a lot of story in this fish, so I was very excited. Uh, I'm very excited uh, in Chennai. So, uh, but there are a lot of fish I don't know. So I want to try a lot of fish in Chennai. Uh, so I. I want to go there again and uh, I will try a lot of the fish. Uh, of course, raw fish and uh, uh, small fish and uh, grilled. So, I want to uh, dry fish also. I want to try a lot of the uh, dif a lot of different kind of uh, cooked patterns and then I will eat a lot. So, uh, if you want to see a lot of the a lot of the fish please subscribe my channel thank you bye